What's going on everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Today we're about to go over how to use the new collections in MLB The Show 24. Hit that red subscribe button, drop a thumbs up on the video. It's a lot of questions on Twitter. Make sure that you follow me on there so you can be updated. Let's go. So using the collections in MLB The Show 24, they added a few more steps. So if you've been having trouble, if you're one of the ones that's been asking questions in the comment section or on Twitter, I'm going to walk you through it. So you're going to go over, push R1, RB, go to collections. It don't matter what collection you are doing. Season 1, Season 2. Now you can see at the top left, they have pages. So once you go in and you select all the people that you want to collect and not sell, then you're going to go here, you're going to collect all of them. This is going to be on page one. This is going to help you get Nolan Arenado. This is going to help you get season collections done. So right here, we have 105 out of 230. Once you collect them, if you push R1 or RB, that will take you to page two. You collect them and your overall will start going up so if you have 101 and you have another five on page two that will put you up to 106 if on page three you have another 10 or 15 extra cards that will help you build up to be able to get the 120 okay so it's not going to always be just one page if you have the cards it might be on page two it might be on page three or it might be on page four so you want to do each one of the pages individually and that's going to help you collect the people even if you go to season one collections and you get your wild cards and the xp path unlocked and you want to use the 99 willie mays or you want to use one of the season one pitchers you do the same method this one right here you can see is eight pages in the top left corner look at the top left page two of eight page three of eight page four of eight I don't myself have all the extra players, but if you have collected and played the game a lot since the beginning of the season, you can fulfill this, get all the way up to 340 collected plus, and you can use these season one cards to have a boost on your rank season progress. Okay, so if you have all three wild card slots, you can go ahead, put in two good hitters and a pitcher or you can use all season one 99 overall pitchers and that's going to give you the smallest advantage and it's all about having advantages you can use core cards like you can see right here if you have the collections done or you can use the 99 overall beast against a lot of people that are only 91 92 93 overall teams unless you are playing the top five percent i hope this helps you out page one page two page three all in the top left corner to unlock everything this is super easy i hope this helped you guys out let's go